Hello everyone, today we'll take a look at the best espresso machines in the market for 2023. I made this list based on my personal opinion, and I'll try to help you find the right one for your needs. To see the most up-to-date prices and find out more information about these espresso machines, you can check out the links in the description below. Let's get started. Number 1. Breville Bambino Plus Espresso Machine the Breville Bambino Plus impressed us in our testing, consistently producing high-quality espresso and offering an excellent automatic milk frother for the extra professional finishing touch. It's difficult to produce a bad coffee from this particular espresso machine, and with a speedy 3-second heat-up time you'll be enjoying a fantastically brewed shot in no time at all. Like many of the best espresso machines, you can adjust the espresso settings for a shorter or longer shot. However, the adjustable pre-infusion settings here are particularly impressive. Similarly, being able to customize both the temperature and texture of the milk while also automatically steaming luscious microfoam was a particular draw in our testing. Some reviewers note that the portafilter that holds the filter with ground coffee can stick after you pull a shot, an issue we've also experienced on occasion. Users who love to be hands-on may balk at trading customization of each cup for consistency, but most people will find the compromise worth the guarantee that you'll get the same rich, nuanced drink every time. Reasons to buy. Compact size. Good-looking design. Easy to use. Consistently good espresso. Reasons to avoid. No hot water spout. No grinder. Filter basket has a tendency to stick. Number 2. DeLonghi Stolosa Manual Espresso Machine The DeLonghi Stolosa offers one of the best espresso machines at this price point. It's a completely manual machine which means you have to do the grinding, measuring, and tamping, as well as the frothing yourself. However, you can adjust the cup size according to how intense you like your espresso, brew into a travel mug, and make either one or two cups at once. And the boiler is constructed of stainless steel, making this a highly durable machine. The water tank holds about a quart of water, or enough for many cups of espresso, and can be removed from the machine to be filled at the sink. Thanks to its compact size, this machine won't hog too much of your precious countertop space. All in all, this is a great model if you want a really good cup of coffee and don't care too much about lots of bells and whistles. Reasons to buy. Good value for money at less than $100. Compact size for countertop. Solidly built. Reasons to avoid. Manual operation. No grinder. Number 3. Breville Oracle Touch Espresso Machine. You'll pay a premium for the all-in-one convenience of Breville's flagship Oracle Touch, but you'll get a supremely easy-to-use machine equipped with double boiler so you can pull a shot and steam milk simultaneously. Fill up the half-pound hopper with beans, lock in the portafilter, and the machine takes care of the rest, precisely grinding and tamping your preferred roasted beans, then extracting a judicious amount of flavor with the consistency of a professional. The steam one even self-cleans itself between sessions. A lot of the magic of the Oracle touches it in behind its full color touch interface with pictures of coffee drinks to choose from, a, a feature sure to impress guests. Dose amount, water temp, and pressure, and steam pressure are all internally optimized. Set the milk pitcher under the nozzle and it frosts without any need for you to hold the pitcher and move it around. What makes this one of the best espresso machines, however, is the fact that there are still plenty of variables for you to dial in. From grind fineness to temperature and texture, there's plenty to tinker with, and you'll also get the option of saving up to 8 settings into memory. Reasons to buy. Built-in hopper and burr grinder. Touchscreen controls. Bars to brood flavor. Reasons to avoid. Very expensive at over $2,000. It takes up a lot of counter space. Number 4. Sylvia version 3 espresso machine. Its no-nonsense style and stainless steel panel give the Rancilio Sylvia the look of a commercial machine in miniature. And indeed, this model is capable of the kind of superb extraction you expect from a professional barista. It's a great choice for anyone who likes a hands-on approach to the espresso-making process as you have to measure out your own coffee, tamp it down in the filter, and then after pressing the coffee button, stop brewing when your desired amount is dispensed into your cup. The Sylvia comes equipped with a steam wand that's considered one of the best in its class as it offers a complete range of motion, and you can adjust steaming pressure in granular increments. The model has gone through various improvements over the years. On the current one, there's an improved, more ergonomic portafilter handle similar to the ones on Rancilio's higher-priced commercial machines. What you don't get are some of the conveniences found on more consumer-oriented machines like a reservoir that you can fill at the sink and a water spout for easily making tea or Americanos. If you want hot water, you need to use the steam wand. 
Reasons to buy. Compact design. Commercial quality components. Consistent results. Reasons to avoid. No grinder. Water tank isn't removable. 3.5 minute warm up. Number 5. Philips 3200 series fully automatic espresso machine. The Philips 3200 series doesn't come cheap, but it brings a lot to the table. This espresso machine lets the user create beverages which would usually require bars to level experience at the push of a bun. It comes with several settings, including espresso, hot water, cappuccino, coffee, latte macchiato, and americano. Plus, there's the option to customize your selection by strength, size, and the amount of steamed milk. When we tried it out for ourselves, we found the coffee it produced tasted good and was not overly bitter. While we were generally pleased with the results, it could have tasted stronger. This was even the case when we adjusted it to its finest grind setting. The quality of the crema was on the thin side too. For this reason, we wouldn't recommend this machine to anyone who likes their coffee to pack a punch. We found similar results after steaming milk as well while it held its form. It wasn't as dense as it could have been. However, while the overall performance was somewhat average, operation couldn't be much more straightforward. And with the attachments being easy to remove and clean, the latte go parts can even go in the dishwasher. It's a nice offering if you value simplicity above all. Reasons to buy. Thoughtful design. Easy to clean. Simple to use. Reasons to avoid. Coffee kind of weak. Milk foam could be denser. 